welcome back to the channel. Absolutely massive match today. Oxford versus Bolton. Under the new leadership of Des Buckingham, we just lost 2-0 to Cheltenham. But that's how Liam Manning started his season against Cambridge, what I also did a log on. Uh, so hopefully we can get a 1-0 win today or something like that because the other... Uh, the second game Liam Manning played this season when he was our manager, but obviously he's a snake. Uh, we won one nil, Mark House goal. But we're missing Vuban tonight because he got a red card. But let's go. The dad, we just got stuck in traffic. It, we've got 15 minutes to get there. Hopefully we'll get it in time. But sort the traffic out in Oxford. What's your score prediction, Dad? Do you know what? Bolton have got a very good defence. They haven't let a goal in in ages. And, uh, you know, Mark Harris isn't firing. A donker's not firing. We haven't got Greg Lee, our super scorer. So I'm going to stick my neck out and go nil nil. Even after Exeter winning 7 nil? I, I, think they'll, I don't think they're going to be as good today. Remember, Exeter lost 9 nil to Reading. And Reading on bottom. Yeah. Coming out, but I'm not sure we're going to miss kickoff. First is Bolton Wanderers in Skynet Week One, and these are your two teams for the night's game. We've got the same best we had against Brighton today. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
from first and fourth, and we'll see back here again very, very soon. Good luck to the United. Good night. for watching guys like subscribe turn the notification bell on come on the news we're third but we've got peterborough then reading i think we've got a few games and then after that we should have a bit of good form and easy teams well there's no easy teams in this division but games we can win so come on you yellows and on to the peterborough but i'm not going to go to that uh, i might go to the match tomorrow but i don't know